poppin'. It's your boy, Kaden, Alpha Nerd of Week. And it, it's a reason women don't submit to you, bro. And that's the same thing that it takes to make a woman submit to you, bro. Honestly, you want to know what that thing is? I'm going to get straight to it. That thing is leaving, bro. To make a woman submit to you, you have to be willing to leave when you don't get what you want. You have to be willing to righteously leave, though. It can't be, oh, I got to leave as a technique, catering to make her come back to me or whatever. No, you are leaving because this woman isn't appearing the way you want to. She bitching you or she she cucking you, whatever. But you're choosing to leave righteously, bro. And the reason that you're doing that is because this woman is going to learn that if she doesn't behave, she's going to lose you, right? You have to be willing to walk away and be willing for her to never come back, bro, to get your point across, to get to to move on, to do what it is that you want or to search out what it is that you want. You have to be a man who makes his decisions and those decisions have to be final. So you leave, you leave. A lot of y'all bitches, bro. Honestly, I'm going to be real with you. A lot of y'all bitch ass. Like, you leave and then you wait on her to call. You wait on her to call. As soon as she calls you, you go running back to her. And everything, the same thing that it was when you left. Because you go running back with the same behavior, same mindset, same everything. And who would submit to that? She know you bluffing. It's like playing poker and everybody at the table could see the fact that you bluffing, bro. You're bluffing. No one fucking cares, bro. Why should she? Why should she submit to that? She know you weak. She know you only leaving as a technique. Women can sense that shit. But no, when you a man about it, when you really mean what you say, bro, when, when you know for a fact beyond a shadow of a doubt that, hey, this relationship ain't going the way I want to. We ain't having enough sex. We ain't having enough whatever. Whatever the case, bro. You willing to walk away and you willing to mean it and you willing to go find somebody else who who will do what you want them to do or find a female that will submit to you in the way that she want to. That That's what really make women submit. That's what really make them submit. When they sense it, they know that you will righteously leave. Do you, do you want to know why? Because your happiness, bro, should be paramount. Your happiness should be the pinnacle, the most important thing. Because guess what? Your happiness, right, trickles down. Your happiness means she happy. And that's what all these women want. They want to be happy, right? Like, let's think about it in the simplest terms, bro. I don't believe in that happy wife, happy life bullshit for some of you purple pill guys who marry or some of you purple pill dudes. I don't believe in that happy wife, happy life bullshit. You want to know why? Because for every happy wife or happy woman, it's a fucking miserable man somewhere. Unless the happiness is trickling down from him. Unless he's the original source of the happiness. So that's what you want to be. But I'm digressing, bro. Anyway, if you want to make her submit, bro, she has to know for a fact that she could lose you, bro. She has to know for a fact that you're willing to walk away and mean that. How do I do that, Katie? I don't know how to make her see that I leave. I don't know how to make her see that. This is how you make her see, bro. So say, for example... Y'all have an argument, right? She, I don't know, on the phone or something, right? And y'all argue, blah, blah, blah. She hang up the phone on you, bro. Or anything of that sort. You never call her. If she never calls you back again, bro, y'all will never talk again. If she never comes to see you again or put herself in your orbit again, you will never see her again. You will never talk to her again. And you have to do that because you have to show her, I'm willing to lose everything to gain everything. I'm willing to risk anything to gain everything. And women submit to that. You want to know why they submit to that? Because that is strength, bro. That's strength. It's a reason why the dudes, you see the women 
flailing after the dudes who like broke up with them. Like if a man break up with a woman, you break up with her when she do something that's bullshitting you. Like women will sabotage the relationship on purpose, bro, just so you could break up with her. And the longer you don't break up with her, the longer you let her do the fuck shit, the more she going to emasculate you, bro. You want to know why? Because it's a test until she eventually she ain't got no more attraction for you at all, bro. She'll emasculate you and she won't care about it, bro. Once she finally can't stand your face no more, bro, she'll break up with you. Then she going to go tell everybody it was your fault when honestly she sabotaged the relationship. Because she couldn't stand you no more. You keep failing these tests. You should have been broke up with her, bro. When, she, when you seen those text messages in her phone. Or when she went two months without giving you sex. Knowing damn well that ain't never been a thing in y'all relationship. You should have been broke up with her, bro. You should have been left her, bro. When she went two, three weeks without calling your phone. And then popped back up. When she wants something, you should have been left her, bro. Guess what? When you leave women, it triggers a chase in their brain, bro. This don't mean like if little shit going on, she giving you little shit test in a relationship, you just like overreact and break up with it and all that. That don't mean that. But that means once things get to a point where you are no longer seeing the benefit of the relationship, once things get to the point where you are no longer enjoying the benefit of her submissiveness and her feminine energy, bro, you are to leave her because if you don't, bro, you are going to regret it. You are going to be put in a blue pill, beta male, cuck position, bro. And guess what? You don't get back from that. The only way to get back from that is leaving her. That's the only way to make a woman submit to you. You have to make her miss your presence, bro. Kater, man, I can't, I can't go two weeks without talking to my girl. I can't go a month. You want to know why? Because you a pussy. That's why. That's why. You can't go two weeks, a month. That's because you attached, too attached. That's because you love her more than she loves you. And we all know the person who love the other one the most is in a weak position. And you in a weak position, bro. But you have to man up and you got to be ready to walk away from her, bro. Men who walk away from their woman, men who break up, walk, walk away from their woman. And she call back in a month, two months, two and a half months. Or even women who break up with the dude and then he never call her again and then she reach back out. They in weak positions, bro. When they call you, when they reach back out to you, they in a weak position. And guess what? When they come back, they got to do something. They got to earn their position back in your life. Like I said earlier, a lot of y'all dudes just get them their position back. You hand them their position right back in your life. She go right back to what she had. And guess what? She don't respect that because she don't got to earn it, bro. But guess what? High value males, we ain't got time for that. We got two, three, four, five women trying to take her place in line. And that ain't even the options we ain't talked to yet. Trying to take her place in line. So when she come back, even if you attached to her, because we all done been attached to somebody. Even if you're attached to her, when she come back, she got to do something to earn it. What was that thing you was mad at? Oh, she wasn't giving you enough sex? Oh, you got to suck. You got to go down on me for two hours or all weekend long. Oh, you wasn't giving me enough sex? Okay, cool. You got to show me you can give me sex every day, baby. Every day until your doc come on. Every day. You miss a day, you out. At least for the first two weeks. You have to create a standard when they return, bro. And guess what? She going to submit to your will, bro. She is going to submit to you. That don't mean get overly aggressive and weird and shit. That just means if she's not willing to follow your program, bro, leave her. She gone. She out. But anyway, this is the true and only way to make a woman truly submit to you. I'm, I'm talking about give you her soul, submit to you. This is the only way to do it, bro. 
yeah, they're going to be submissive in the beginning because everybody's trying to get the feel out, the honeymoon phase and everything. But the only true way to make a woman submit to you, other than always being in your masculine frame, is that when she has to feel like she can lose you. She has to feel like her place is never secure, bro. So keep that in mind. It's your boy Kaden Alpha Nerd. I'm out of here. If you enjoyed this, if you got something from this video, it will help me out a lot if you like the video and subscribe to the channel. It's your boy. I'm out of here.